just you just pay this guy to sit in here and, and watch your car. Well, yeah, I ordered him online from Russia. It's pretty good work for a washed-up boxer. And what about this car? I thought you sold it when you put the money back. Well, I kind of found some extra money they forgot about. Well, this is developing into a pretty dangerous situation. Nah. Hey, speaking of developing... I have some theories about why girls are turning into women sooner. I don't think they're putting anything in the water, man. You sure? Getting big pretty early these days. I think they're just showing them off earlier. You can thank Britney Spears for that. And I do. Hey, you gonna take me to those little chick hangouts? You always go to and you keep top secret from me? There are no secret hangouts. I went in on the trick. There's no, there's no trick. Hey, G? Yeah. Yeah. The thing is, G, there's, there's no trick to what I achieve or don't achieve. I just, it's a toss of the coin or a roll of the dice or whatever. Just, I think that part of your problem with, with getting to sleep at night and staying awake with conspiracy theories is that you're spooking yourself with, with something that you're looking to happen to you. And that, that might not ever happen. But that's life, you know, that's, that's just how it works. Ever since we were kids, I felt this, this strange guilt. I felt this strange guilt because for, for one reason or another, life continually deals me better hands than you. You know, I, my high school had, had lab time and, and yours had farm economics. For Christmas, I got a computer and you got a, an Atari. You know, I, I went on to MIT and you got a two-year degree in some tech school. And now, you know, I'm working for the Ricci's in London and New York, and I, I live in a house with rooms I've never seen and yachts I've never sailed, and you live on some pond and commute to Milwaukee to deal with Diamani's bullshit. I just... I just want you to know that I'm really proud of you and everything you've accomplished. And without without any kind of luck whatsoever. Dude, we've only known each other for a couple of years. Well, I think you just need something to, to snap your confidence up. You know, something to, to slip you right into your zone. You, just, you gotta find your zone. My zone? that? Uh, you know, your zone, it's, you know, there's just one thing, there's something to boost your confidence a little, man. You know, there's got to be one thing that's really nagging at you, that if you accomplished it, you know, if you tackled it and, and saw it through, you'd, you'd feel better. And you'd be in your zone, and good things would come to you. There's got to be one thing. Well, there is one thing. So I decided to take Trevor's advice. I thought, what's the one thing that really pisses me off? That's Tommy and his stupid Pontiac Sunbird. Dude, your vet can't touch this thing. Dude, your vet can't touch this. Dude, your vet can't touch this. Dude, your vet can't touch this. So I challenged him to a race. We decide noon, high noon, just like the old west. And the stupid meathead doesn't even show up. Single boy, your doors off. Single boy, your doors off. Single boy, your doors off. Bet he's laughing his south side ass off. I tested it last week at 320 horsepower. I tested it last week at 320 horsepower. No more. I'm not taking her crap anymore. I spent all these hours, thankless hours, in the middle of the night. Well, that's it. I'm going over there and settle the score. So when I get over there, listen, G. I, I know you're mad. You're you're, you're super fucking Damn, pissed, I but you, you need to calm off. down and think this through. Shut up. He's your boss, up, after all, and he's connected. 
sort of. My point is that you you just can't go out and make your own rules. You, you can't just go off running into into snap judgments and rash behavior. Gee, I'm serious. Turn the car around and let's go get a drink. Come on. Gee, just stay in the car, bitch. Jesus. Gee, this is Diamani's house. Gee, get back in the car. Get back in the car.